the golden spice turmeric has been in the news a lot lately, mostly because this spice is a natural anti-inflammatory. And so if you can get it into your meals, you're really smart. Some people have been asking me, what's an easy way to get it into my vegetables? And I'm going to show you an easy way that I like to do it. I like to make roasted cauliflower with a little bit of turmeric and some other spices. So I've already prepped my cauliflower. It's in little florets. And you know, these I've got a little issue going on with my hand right now. And so I'm really trying to find recipes that don't take a lot of chopping. And this one does not. So right now, if you look in your grocery store, you may even find bags of cauliflower florets ready to go. So you don't even have to buy the whole head of cauliflower. Or you can go to a salad bar in the grocery store and buy some cauliflower florets right from the salad bar and they're ready to go. So I've got those ready to go. I've got my oven at 425 degrees and now I'm going to mix up a little spice mixture that includes turmeric. So I'm going to start with the turmeric. Actually I measured this out already. So one teaspoon of ground turmeric and I also like to use a teaspoon of ground cumin. That gives a little bit of spice. And you know me and spice, I do like spice. So I'm gonna add a little bit of chili powder too, about three fourths of a teaspoon. And then because I like it really hot, I'm going to add a little Thai chili pepper. And then some salt, about a teaspoon to a teaspoon and a half of salt. And then some oil. I'm using avocado oil. Avocado oil is a good high heat oil. Just whisk it up to blend. And then I'm going to add my cauliflower florets. And I would use a whole head of cauliflower. This is actually just half of a head because I wanted to make some ahead of time so you could see what it looked like when it comes out of the oven. So just keep tossing this up until it's completely coated with that turmeric mixture. So just push this out onto your baking sheet and spread it out. You don't really want the little florets to be touching because you don't want this to steam. You want it to roast. Then put it into the oven, 425 degrees for about 20 minutes. And I like to stir it about halfway through so it gets nice and golden brown on all sides. And when this turmeric cauliflower comes out of the oven, you can see it's just nice and golden brown. It's a little bit spicy, really tender, and so delicious. And so, so easy. I mean, it's practically so easy you could make it with one hand. I'm Sue Doden sharing Good Food for Good Life 365.